यू गेट द क्वेस्ट एज यू रीच दी हाईलाइटेड लोकेशन इन सेंट जॉर्ज होल यू हैव टू कम हेयर एट नाइट आफ्टर नाइन पी एम टू गेट द क्वेस्ट Did you change the door codes? No. Never mind. You probably don't know how. Are you guessing him his porridge? No. I'm turning the alarm system back on which someone left off. You want some downer to walk in and take all our reserves? Why don't you tell the whole bloody neighborhood we've got reserves? Oh yes. You must tell me about your wonderful reserves. You don't know that for sure. Don't worry, I turned the alarm back on. It's your turn, you know. He's your dad. It's hardly my fault, is it? I made the porridge. The least you can do is bring it up to him. It wasn't my idea for him to live with us. As I recall, you wanted him to move out. It was the decent thing for him to do. Make way for the new generation. How can they talk about him like that? He was a war hero in two wars. But they didn't even fight. What lovely people. Remind me never to have kids. Well, it's not terribly likely anyway, is it? Please just lie down. Not my turn. I found a loose bullet down in the mud the other day. Do you think it could still be good? I wouldn't say that around the Sarge. Where did you go? Who's that? I don't have time for this. You're not Regina, and you're not my son-in-law, and he isn't the stones to have me drowned in a cask of Malmsey. <laughs> so you're a burglar. Uh, I'm from this city. We're uh, tracking a problem in the motorline pipes. You're a rotten liar. <laughs> the city stopped taking care of the pipes years ago. I noticed you're not screaming for help, though, sir. Have you met my daughter? Frankly, I'd rather give my stuff to a burglar. <laughs> they don't tell you how rotten they can turn out. I trained grown men to make their beds and run into machine guns. Kids will break your heart every goddamn day. Thanks for the warning, sir. Does your father know what sort of lad you are? I'm afraid he may have suspected, sir. So you've got regrets. <laughs> Good. Kids downstairs. Any time they start to regret, they pop a joy. Look, take whatever you want. But my brother Edward, haven't seen much of each other these past few years. I'd appreciate it if you'd go tell him I'm, I'm sorry. He'll know what it means. He's on Monmouth Road, number twenty-two. Huh. Used to be the most wonderful cheese shop on the corner. I'll be sure to pass along the message, sir. Is that yours? Now you have to go to the other soldier's house. His location I'll is at the other end the of the town. Location will be marked on your map. You should not have any I'll problem reaching there. Them. Hello? Hello? Captain Lawrence? I've got a message for you, sir. Captain Lawrence, sir? You particularly like her. That's not a good sight. Climbing. My dog. 
They were fighting over a dog. Now go back to Colonel Lawrence's house and talk to him. Your brother. I'm afraid I'll, I've been to his house. So I was too late. How? An accident. With a bookcase. Ah, shit. Shit. What's the use? I meant to talk to him sooner. I wrote him so many letters. Maybe I should have sent them. No, sir. Thank you, sir. I, uh... I don't suppose you found a footlocker there? A footlocker? No. I left a footlocker in his house. I'd rather you have it. That's very kind of you. Uh, where is it? Regret. It's what makes us human, son. Don't forget that. No, sir. Thank you, sir. Well, I think this might fit, actually. I'd need the trousers. Now again go back to the other old soldier's house. Place the rifle that you got from Colonel Lawrence Footlocker on the rifle stand to reveal a secret ladder. Join the army as an officer, unless. No 